Morirai. 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 What the fuck? What is up, guys? Welcome to an episode of Morirai. Let's get right into it. Don't even bother asking me uh, where I found this game or what is this game because honestly, I have no clue. It looked retarded. Um, it probably is retarded. So we will experience this together. Um, okay. Please don't touch me, priest. All right, we got out of that one. I didn't get touched. He definitely touched this little boy right here. Okay, um... To be perfectly honest, I don't really even want to go in those houses. I just want to go straight. Okay, read signpost. Farm. Wow, very descriptive. We can poke the sheep. Um... We can't enter the barn. Who would have thought? Okay, let's go this way. Is he an enemy? Please tell me he's not an enemy, dude. Can I take that? I got it. Can I take this? Is that an axe? I can't take it. Oh, he's friendly. I probably should have read that. Uh, I'll start here. He should have been back by now. I'm worried. Can you check up on him? There's a lantern behind you on that stump. Yeah, screw you. I already got it. Thank you. All right, uh, let's go in. Is, what the, is that his brother? Hey you, come over here. Hey you, come over here. Did my brother send you? Bless him. The moans are coming from further down. I'd go in, but my sight's no good, because I'm a fat fuck. You should take this knife. Who knows, you may need it. Wow, thank you. So generous. So that's a dead end. Um, I don't know where this leads. Is, I think this might be a horror game. I know I said earlier, don't ask me where I got it, but I was kind of a little quick to the draw on that. I got it on Steam. I was looking for retarded horror games. Uh, and I found this one. And it is so far retarded. So, um... Yeah, I guess we're just experiencing this game together that you can't even move the cursor on. At least we have a weapon. That's good. Um, okay. Yeah, we're, okay. We're back where we were. That, that honestly probably scared some people, <laughs> seeing that guy come out of nowhere. What is through here? See, I don't like these big open spots like this. Oh, Jesus. Farmer approaches. Um, I guess here's some questions we can ask him. The pretty obvious one, why do you have blood on your overalls? I want, I want to play. Oh God, why do you have a knife? To cut in beautiful flesh. I heard the moans, what have you done? I don't want to tell. Um, let them pass or attack. I feel like he's a serial killer, so... Okay, uh, wait, he's dead. There's a name on the farmer's overalls. Nicholas. Uh, good to know. So I assume, it, or I'm assuming he killed someone? Um... Yeah, he killed someone. Oh, she's alive. I came here to end my life. My name is Julia and I want to see my child and husband in heaven. My husband was a miner in these caves. He spent days mining for gold and then one day he found something. He found a golden nugget. I, t <laughs> I thought we could ret retire and, and be comfortable for the rest of our lives, but he didn't trust me. He buried the golden nugget to spite me, then he disappeared. Everyone in the town heard about our good fortune. They thought I was rich. I was so ashamed that I couldn't tell them the truth. What is this? One day my son wandered into the cave. He wanted to find his daddy. He wanted to make everything better. But he never came out of the cave. I went to look for him, but I couldn't find him. Now it's too late. Now I have nobody. That's pretty depressing. 
Will you help me? Will you help me in my life? You've done it before. It should be easier the sec. How does she know I killed that guy? Um. Let's get her some help. Then leave me, you coward. All right, can we kill her now? She called me a coward. I guess not. Okay, let's let's get her some help. I feel like I might. Oh, okay, good. He's the guy I killed earlier. But he was facing this way. Now he's facing this way. Maybe that's just the game, or maybe that's creepy. I don't. I don't know to be honest. Okay. I. Oh God. I looked up to make sure my my screen was recording, and now this guy's coming at me. A farmer approaches. Why do you have blood on your overalls? I guess he's asking me the same questions. Uh, I I killed I killed a farmer. Let, let's be honest. Let's see what happens. Now let's say I killed a murderer. Why do you have a knife? To circumcise you. I heard moans. What have you done? Nothing. Bitch. Let me see what will happen to you. And now this is where the story shall end, at least for now. It's up to, it is up to the next player of this game to choose your fate, just as you chose for the previous player. So was the previous player the guy who I killed? Enter your first name, okay. Okay, thank you for playing. That was it? That That's the whole game? What What is this? Oh my gosh, dude. What What was that? Come on. All right, we're, we're gonna do some research and, and, and figure out what this game really was. Uh, stay tuned. Okay, so I went back on Steam and I uh, looked at about this game, and apparently this is uh, like the gist of it. The townsfolk tell you that a woman named Julia has gone missing. You venture out into the cave just beyond the village looking for her. You give it a knife to protect yourself. What you find there may surprise you. More, 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 I got it. Google Translate, thank you. Is an experimental first person game created by Chris Johnson. Uh, names I'm not gonna shout out so uh, yeah so that's pretty much what it was I guess random people just come along and then like play it after you and it just is a never-ending repeating cycle uh, I don't know pretty cool uh, fun fun game would give it a 5 out of 10 because I didn't enjoy it that much it was kind of dumb but a little bit fun. So like this video, subscribe, comment, and see you in the next one. Peace out, guys.